Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. Okay, so in the last video we pitched our yeast and in this video we're gonna learn how to check our alcohol by volume. So remember two videos ago, right before we transferred our wart from our kettle to our carboy, we set a little bit aside. Well, let's go ahead and talk about it. Okay, so here I have my hydrometer in my plastic test jar. And a hydrometer is a tool that measures liquid density to the relativity of water. Just stay with me. See, if we use basic tap water at room temperature, our hydrometer will be floating at 1.000. See it up there, second from the top? But we don't have water. We have water mixed with grains, hops, sugar, and yeast that will start working in about eight hours. Okay, let's look at our hydrometer. You see the 10, 20, 30, 40, etc. under the 1.000. Those are actually in the hundreds and thousands column. So right now, we're trying to find out our original gravity, AKA before fermentation. Our reading may look like 47 or 48. We'll call it 48 but the way we read it is really 1.048. Okay, so now what do we do with this 1.048 reading? We need to combine it with our FG gravity, our final gravity, but how do we get that? I'm gonna fast forward ahead. After two weeks of letting our yeast turn our sugar into alcohol, we test this again, the same exact way, but make sure you do it before you bottle or keg your beers, before carbon dioxide. Okay, so what are we gonna do? First things first, we're gonna Google alcohol by volume calculator and plug it into our OG before alcohol and FG after alcohol and we get to see how much alcohol by volume is in our beers. You can also get the same formula by subtracting the final gravity from the original gravity and multiplying it by 131.25, but I suck at math and would rather use this website. Oh, and make sure when you're done testing your final or original gravity, you just have enough liquid so that your hydrometer is floating. All right, guys, good luck with this. We're like one video away, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Great job so far.